I was always chasing something, right? Chasing adrenaline, chasing girls, running the streets, whatever it was, I just, you know, was just out there, kind of wild. Being raised by a single mom, we, we kind of had some struggles. But as I continue to, to grow, uh, at an early age, I was introduced to drugs. About 13 years old, started smoking weed, uh, got into high school and continued down that path, you know, just making the wrong friends, running the streets, getting into trouble. After 18, started community college, started to do kind of good in community college, but still couldn't shake the drugs. I mean, I was getting high every single day, smoking weed, then I got introduced to pills. I did everything under the sun except put a needle in my arm. Ended up in my mid 20s, getting locked up. I remember waking up the, the first day that next morning on the top bunk, looking at a light. And I'd never felt that kind of tired in my life. It was like the deepest soul, like every fiber in my body was, was just tired. And I hopped up off that bunk and to this day, I still remember my feet hitting the floor that morning. As I walked down the stairs to use the phone for the first time to call home, I heard, I heard the Lord speak to me for the first time and I just heard peace. I knew deep down inside I had to pick up the Bible. I didn't know nothing about Jesus growing up, right? Like we were your typical Christmas, Thanksgiving and Easter, the, the Super Bowls. You know, he spoke to me that first time and I did exactly what he told me to do. I was obedient and followed through with what he told me. And the whole time I was locked up for that whole year, I just kept my nose in the Bible, learned how to pray, got out of there, continuing to seek the Lord. I started to grow in the Lord and a couple years in, I picked up fishing. I never fished growing up at all. And I fell in love with the outdoors. And through a series of events, I ended up contacting Blast and Cast almost four years ago. and. They brought me on, super grateful, privileged to be able to work with these guys and be around other men that, that love the Lord. And now, you know, part of my life is dedicated to pointing outdoorsmen to the cross. Found the thing that I was chasing and it was, it was Jesus. It was the fountain of living water. I was always thirsty for something, always chasing. But when I took that first drink, it satisfied me for the rest of my life. And I've never looked back and if, if you're a guy out there and you've been chasing, if you've been seeking rest, if your life is in chaos, Jesus will bring that peace. He is peace himself and he will bring order where there is chaos in your life. He's, he's sure to be found. He says, when you seek me with all of your heart, I will be found by you. He says, if you draw near to me, I will draw near to you. He says, come to me and I will give you rest. And if you're, if you're seeking rest, if you just call out to him, he'll give it to you.